this water is fresh. This is the first time there's a full bottle. There's the first time we've done this. And this family's washing their clothes here. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, that's helped me so much. I can't thank you enough. Today we're gonna go do something that I've never done before. So you're gonna come with me for that. Uh, I come from Southern California and we have very dirty water in California. However, in the Philippines right here, the ocean is very clean. And we're gonna go get some water from Napa An. It's a uh, fresh water springs. I have nine bottles five gallon bottles in the back of my truck and just for fun we're gonna go fill up some water bottles and we're gonna try out this natural spring yes it's just something that i've never done i usually just pay for a water but i thought let's go ahead and let's test out the water the natural spring water in the philippines we've been really busy lately it's been really hectic we've been doing a lot of exercising and we did the All Souls Day yesterday. It was kind of a fun activity. And paying honor and, and homage to the people who had passed away. But today we're on the living. We're on the living today. And we're gonna try to have some living fresh spring water. We're gonna try our luck. See all this fresh water coming out of the out of the PVC pipe and it's really fresh. The water looks great. Good for drinking, right? It's a good drinking water. It looks great. And then we're filling up all the bottles. And uh, what's your name? Marvik. Marvik? Yep. Thank you, Marvik. I hope you're doing well today. We're in the Ford F-150 truck. The big truck. I like this truck. It's from America. And when I was in Manila, my friend Rick, he has a Toyota Hilux, and I really squeezed in that Hilux. I didn't drive it, but I was in the passenger seat, and the Hilux was so small because I got wide shoulders. And for me, having a big pickup truck is nice and comfortable compared to, let's say, the Hilux, the small truck made for the smaller people. It just didn't fit me very well. Oh, that's so cool. Yes, my kids. What's your What's your name? Phineas. Phineas? Yes. Oh, hi, sweetheart. Say hello. Hi. I know that guy. <laughs> the water is really muddy, and then this drinking water is really clean. Yes. I was shocked. I thought, oh my gosh, the drinking water is going to be muddy, but it's That'll beautiful. Be huh? It's very clean. It's very, very clean. We're on the road turning to Napa, Napa An. Right there is a sign. And we're just gonna turn right here. And we're gonna head on over to the springs. This is where we go swimming. It's a really great swimming hole. And we're not gonna swim today. We're gonna fill up the water. No chemicals. No chemicals, pure water from the Philippines. It's a beautiful area. It's very gorgeous. Look at this. This is where we go swimming normally. But today we're gonna fill up the water bottles only. Gotta watch out, there's a big blind curve here. You don't wanna hit a motorcycle. But it's just gorgeous in the Philippines. That's why I like it so much. It's so nice. We're in like the jungle and it's just a beautiful, clean environment. And who doesn't like living in a clean environment? That's why this is a good country because they have such good natural resources. Uh, like, where are you from, sir? I'm from California. Oh, California? Like I said before, the Filipinos are really, they're nice people. Are you sure? I can't give you like 50. No? No, sir. See, people are so nice. Thank you very much. Guy, we got all nine bottles. Thanks to my amigo here. This truck is full of water and it looks like good. Thank you, brother. Oh, such good people, man. I really appreciate that. Okay, sir. I didn't expect that. Thank you so much. Thank you, brother. See, it's nice in the Philippines and people are good and it's just a friendly place and the water is very clean. A couple of ladies here 
We're trying not to run over. Beep, 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 beep. I almost ran those ladies over. I can't wait to drink. My water is like empty at home. I'm all sweaty. I did like half the work and this guy did like the other half or more. And there's the sign. And it looks like we're at Napa on here. Welcome. Welcome to Napa on. We have all these water bottles. We have a bunch of water bottles we're getting out of the truck. I'm trying to carry them. Carry the selfie stick. I'm having a hard time. But here we are. We're at the entranceway to the Golden Arches here. The, we're going to fill up these water bottles. I have a whole, like I say, nine water bottles in the back of this truck. I have to jump this fence bamboo. And we're going to go ahead and check this place out. Just taste this fresh water. I, like I mentioned, I never had fresh water before from the ground. And I'm going to fill all my bottles up and I hope I don't get sick. I probably won't get sick, but it's going to be a lot of fun to like try this out. Maybe, maybe I like this kind of stuff and maybe I drink this water from now on. We've got these dogs here. We've got to get these guys out of our way. All it, doggies, all it. Go home. Over here is the bridge. I always ride my motor. It's a flat entry ramp and I go up this ramp and I ride my bike across this bridge over here that takes you to this little barangay area. And it's nice, it's just fun. And if you want to scare a girl, you just put her on the back of your bike and you go on that bridge. It's pretty scary. I love baby girls. I would love to have a baby girl. <laughs> They're so cute. A baby girl, like this baby girl right here. I would love to have one just like that. She's adorable. The boys, I don't know about them. But the girls, they're adorable. See the blue PVC pipe? That's the drinking water. And let's check out. Look, a lot of water coming out of there. Oh, we can fill up the water bottle quite nicely. So we're going to fill the water bottles up right now. Well, they are really sweet. <laughs> okay. We got another bottle here. Oh. Oh. Hi. It's Brian. You just filled the water bottle from the natural spring. And we're gonna take it to the truck. It's good exercise. I thought I was not gonna exercise today, but I find ways to exercise and lift weights. Good exercise for the arms. Carrying a whole stack of five gallon water bottles. But we're working for our money. <laughs> I got this heavy bottle and I hope I don't fall. Then you gotta jump over this. They have a bamboo thing here. And then you have, we gotta figure out what's the best way to to do this so I don't lose the water. We don't want to lose the water. We work too hard to get it. Walking to my truck is not nice. <laughs> this is the bad part is walking with these bottles up these dirt road with my feet. But thanks so much for hanging out with us today in Napa on and getting this fresh water. Thank you so much. And we're going to see you yeah, we're going to see you with some water. We're going to see you next time.